what is up guys Josh here and before the video starts I just want to let everyone know that this is an amalgamation of four videos I've already made um, I've cut the ends and the beginnings off of them so if there's language I use in it that confuses you or if um, the editing's a bit off it's because I've literally just cut the video up the, the all four videos like end and front and then just put them all together so that's that's why uh, so like and subscribe and enjoy the video guys let's get into it okay so the first one is a bit of a weird one because the area that I'm about to take you to now isn't actually in the original game so it was really hard for me to figure out where this first one was because I'm basing it off with a lot of them are in the same place as the old ones and I already collected it in my playthrough but it is right there on the table right at the back turn left you can't miss the building just walk right up to the table and take your first one and the second one I also already took but it's just after you finish clearing out the school and it is right on the table with a mouse and keyboard so that is where it is as you can see it's not there but it was because I collected it in my playthrough and uh, the next one will be just outside the school and it is right there on a box you can't miss it but uh, yeah that's the third one and then over to the next one this is on cliffhanger uh, it's just before just after you learn about the heartbeat sensor just before you uh, enter the base uh, you just walk straight forward climb up some stairs I miss the stairs here's your next enemy intel or four uh, yeah I don't know why it took me so long to move on to the next video the next one is um, after you've gone after you planted the bomb just before you meet back up with soap just take a right walk all the way up to here, look through a window and there's your fifth enemy intel there's a guy in there uh, you know no witnesses you know even though he had headphones in he probably didn't hear anything but just in case and uh, now the next one's a little bit tricky, uh, but you're on the snowmobile and you just have to drive over it. I took ages trying to find this, but what I've found is wait for him to wait for soap to say "come on, come on," so you know you're in the right place, and then just go straight into the bushes, and your intel should be right around there somewhere. So the first one is just after you take out Rojas's second-hand man, you jump out into all the houses where you get attacked by like a million guys. If you just stick to your left until you get to a, this wall you'll see the overhang which is where you know where you're going you just go straight ahead and into the building and the intel's right there on the table so the next one's a little bit further on uh, if you think if you look at the objective when you're about 90 meters and you see a house like this you're in the right place uh, you have to pass this ladder because uh, the objective is up to the left you see this ladder and I'm going to climb it at some point, hang on, yep, there's there's the left. So if you climb up the ladder, uh, there will be a lot of guys, this is a very hectic level for collecting, but the uh, sh the intel should be right there on the table. There we are. And the next one is right after the last one, you just come out the building, turn left, you'll see the steps. Um, I didn't do this in order, so this will come up as the tenth one. Uh, there will be a lot of enemies in this building, you just come in, instead of going up the stairs, turn right, and there's another enemy intel. Knife it. Yep, 9 out of 45 so far. The last one for takedown is just as you look up to the area where Soap tackles that guy, turn around, bring it back a bit to the left where there's guys on top of this thing, jump down onto the balcony, through the door, and there's a bed to the left. And that's the last of the intels for takedown. The next intel is on the level Wolverines, and you can pretty much do these in any order. Uh, but depending on what the objective is, usually depends on what buildings are full of enemies. So uh, first thing is that you're, Nova Gaff, you're at the Nova Gas Station, uh, you just clear out these enemies. You can jump through the window or go through the door, doesn't matter. I decided to go through the window because I'm a legend and it's just on the counter right there. And that is your 11th piece of enemy intel. The next is the left of the Burger Town in a bin and I didn't originally record the lead up to collecting it so I had to do some editing, but you know, there it is. And that's 12. 
The next one is just behind Burger Town at Taco to Go. If you just break the door, jump through the door, and it should be there on the table. And that is 13. And the last one is at CRB Financial, which is the other side of Nate's, which is the original building. Uh, depending on the objective, this is sometimes full of enemies. This wasn't on my run, because uh, I did all this just before I have to get the, sting the first stinger. And as you can tell, I'm having a lot of trouble uh, finding it. But I do find it in the end, and there is your 14th and last one for Wolverines. Okay, so the next intel is on Hornet's Nest, just after you clear the whole uh, the first area, just take a right and go into the building and on the table there'll be another enemy intel. That'll be number 15. Next up, shortly after the last intel, you clear this next big area out. This, uh, just before you go up the steps, look right and you'll see your 16th piece of intel. The 17th piece of intel is in Paleo's, I think I'm saying that right. It's an ice cream parlour, I guess. And uh, yeah, you just go through the door, come right up the stairs. Uh, I do get lost a little bit. I get a bit turned around. I've, I, I'm like, there should be a door here. Am I going the wrong way? Did I go right? No, I didn't go the wrong way. Oh, wait, there's a bit, there's a bit further on. Ah, here it is. There's a door. I go up the steps. And then on the table again, there's an, your 17th piece of intel. The last piece for Hornet's Nest is just behind these goalposts. When uh, while Nikolai is trying to land for the first time, you just ignore him, break the window, and you take your 18th piece of enemy intel. Next up is Exodus, and number 19 can be found in the office next to the Garden Villas sign. This is while you're clearing out the apartments. And uh, so if you just go into the office, go to the end of the room, and number 19 is right there. And I'm just going to shoot around. Oops. Number 20 can be found after you destroy the sentry, and you go to this arch. It is in the right office, just before you enter Arcadia. So you just clear out these guys. Uh, I thought it was at the back of the front of the office. Turns out it was right behind me. So there it is. Number 20. Now, you've just entered Arcadia uh, on the second to last building. On the right, there'll be a fountain outside. You just go in. And this is the last intel for the mission and the video. You just go up the stairs. And it'll be there on the back. Okay, so the first piece of intel on the only easy day was yesterday. Is straight after you uh, breach the first room. You just go right up the stairs and turn left. And that piece of intel will be on a shelf. The next one is after you breach the second room and uh, you blow the C4. You've just got to clear all the enemies out in this area. And the room to the right is where we're going. So when I finally do it, right, yeah, I kill that guy. Go into the room that says 26 to 3 on it. And again, your intel will be on a shelf right in front of you. And the last one for the only easy day was yesterday is... In this big room by here, just a bit further on, you can't really miss it. You just, uh, as you see, I can show you where it is. You just take the long way around because you can't get to it yet. Uh, you just kill, you know, kill a bunch of fools. This, you know, may take you a while if you want to kill everyone. I sort of like to just run past everyone, you know, kill as many as I can and just go. So you go, take a right uh, at the top of the stairs, then go down the stairs. Behind the stairs is your next piece of intel. So next up is the Gulag. And again, another one that's hard to miss. You just, uh, as soon as you see these guys running up the stairs, that's how you know you're in the right place. So you go where they will go in. And at the end of the room upstairs is your first piece of intel for the Gulag. Up next is you just enter the Gulag. Again, very hard to miss. Just follow follow the line, follow along. No worries, you see all these screens and your piece of intel will be... I'm, I'm looking for it, I know where it is. Just behind those screens. And that is intel number 26. We're almost done. Okay, so this next one I collected and failed to hit record because I forgot. So 
Uh, yeah, so this is just after you go through the armory, and this will be the first open cell on your right, and it'll be right where I'm shooting. So, you know, again, pretty easy. And finally, this last one, um, I'm playing the whole thing out from the whole price interaction, because I just love this reunion, and, you know, everyone's just like... Oh hey so, but uh, yeah, price after price socks you won, and you meet up with him, and everything's going to shit. You just get up, look straight left, and the last piece of intel for the gulag is right there, and that's twenty eight out of forty five intel's. On to have their own accord now, and just clear this room out. Uh, go to where Corporal Dunn is uh, hunkered down. And there's a body block in the elevator. From closing, just go in the elevator, and your enemy intel is right there. Your next piece of intel is uh, you come up the stairs, you just kill a couple of guys, trying to uncover that SAM turret missile launcher thing, and you just turn left, turn around. Uh, there's a guy shooting through that door. Just shoot the door so the guy opens it for you. Go in, turn left, and your intel is right there, and that's the last one for this level. On to contingency, and there's the intel. We just take out these three guards. Double headshot, lovely. Then you just go up, and you can pick up the first intel for contingency. Lovely stuff. The next one is uh, after you get the next predator, you just see the big uh, silo that says 33. Go in, turn left, make sure you kill all the guys. You should turn right, but I, for some reason, try and go through a door and look left I get flashed important you get flashed otherwise you won't be able to unlock it that's a lie make sure you spray aimlessly and hurt ghost then you just go forward and collect your next bit of intel finally for this level uh, straight after that you walk out just go straight up these steps up to where the helicopter would be uh, go to the back and your intel is just lying on one of the crates right there and that is 33 on the Whiskey Hotel, and uh, just as you come out of the Oval Office, uh, you'll see there's like a big hole in the wall and, you know, a bunch of bad guys. If you look to your left on the couch, there's your next bit of intel. And the last one for this video, you go to the top of these stairs. Uh, this is when you find out they're going to flatten the city, you need to go pop the flares. You just come up to the top of the stairs, turn right, and there's your last piece of intel. So for the intel in loose ends, you can do it pretty much any order, but this is how I found it easiest. So what you want to do is you want to go around the back of the house first, take this path down to the boathouse, and your first intel will be on a crate right there. Next you want to go upstairs and breach this room just like you normally would. You, you're pretty hard to miss this one. Yes, you just uh, clear this room, and then you go to the, once you kill them, you go to the back of the room, and there is your 37th piece of enemy intel. Next, you want to go downstairs, breach both rooms downstairs, and in the right room, in the armory, is your last piece of intel for this mission. Now, for enemy or my enemy, you just jump down straight away, start the mission, go straight into this cockpit, and you get your first piece of intel. Now for the next one, you'll know you're close because Nikolai speaks Russian. Uh, just go to the top of the hill and the cockpit on your left will be another intel. Now, on to just like old times. You just take out the guard taking a smoke break and run directly forward. And pick up your intel there and then that's 41. Next, after you go loud and everyone knows who you are, just before you go out that door, turn left. And there's your 42nd intel. Now this is just after you cross the bridge with your riot shield. Uh, incredibly easy to get. Just follow the objective to the letter and you will see it on your right. And that's 43. 44 is really hard to miss next to the price. Just before you escape uh, on the table to his left you'll see the intel. 
And finally, the easiest one, I believe, in the game, just before you get on the boat with Price, run down, do a little trick, and collect your 45th piece of intel. And that is it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'm just showing you all the intel cheats that you've now unlocked, all the challenges. There's, uh, what we got? Fortitude, Desperation, Poltergeist, Attraction, Starvation, Bombshell, Precision, and Green Beret. Uh, Pineapple Heads, Think Fast, A Bad Year, Cluster Bombs, Pomegranade, Party Time, Danger Close, Slow Mobility, Ragdoll Impact, and Infinite Ammo. And then I believe it's Cod Noir. Edge Detect and Ragtime Warfare. Like and subscribe guys, thank you so much for watching and peace.